So what was that moment like? Because I, I, I like to ask entrepreneurs and, and people in your position, like what was that moment like when you knew it was time for you to take that leap of faith when mm. you, you walk away from that job? Because a lot of times we don't do it because we have the, we feel like there's security and we want to stay okay. there and play it safe. So for you, when did you know it was time to you know, take that leap of faith? So uh, I, I battled with that for a minute because I, I never could get clear on what it was. And then, you know, a, a lot of people started telling me this and telling me that. And what I realized, I had to really go back to what, you know, what the Bible said about making wise decisions. So there was three things that I did. The first thing I did is I consulted, you know, counsel of the wise. I went to people that were smarter than me in business, smarter than me in the faith, and that was way stronger than I was. And I started counseling with them and, and getting like, hey, look, this is the idea. Am I crazy? Second thing I did is I did a lot of prayer and fasting. Like I spent days of just fasting, not eating, not, you know, and just drinking water to really get my mindset to see is this me or is this what I'm supposed to do? And the third thing I did was I counted the cost. And basically I had to really figure out what made sense for my family because everybody's number is different. Mm -hmm. And then I tell people all this time, uh, tell them all the time is that, you know, I thought I had faith. You don't have faith until you cut off your direct deposit. When you cut direct deposit off, now let's see who you believe in, mm -hmm. right? And so for me, it was that piece right there. And what I've learned is this course is that, man, all of what I'm doing right now has zero to do with me speaking. Nothing. Like it, the business is booming. People want to talk about it all the time. All this has taught me about faith. And because you think, as a, especially as a man, you think you're the one that's bringing home the money. You think you're in control of so much. But when you give up that one piece, what you realize is that you weren't in control then and you sure as heck ain't in control right. now. Because um, I couldn't have, I couldn't have written this the, the the chapters and the stories the way it is, and so for me, knowing it, I had to go through those three processes.